Hi, I'm Louise McLean and I work in the Academy Operations Department. So I've worked here for quite a few years now and every day is different. Um, different things come up all the time, but mostly I look after the B team and all their fixture and their fixture arrangements. Um, and then the younger academy when they're in as well, making sure that um, the coaches have got all the right data for everything, all the, um, the everybody kind of knows where they need to go. And also things like when, when we're allowed to go when we can go tournament organization um, and all that sort of thing just making sure that everybody's got all the right flights and all the right information so they know where they need to be really. I started off doing a degree in sports science at Glasgow University um, and as, as part of that I just knew I really wanted to work in sports and at the time it was a, a volunteering job with a, a local youth team um, and through that I kind of um, got volunteered to take on a job with the Scottish FA and then 15 years later I ended up at Rangers. <laughs> From working with the, the Scottish FA and the, the women's teams I kind of knew that coaching coaching football wasn't really for me. I really enjoyed the sports science, the testing and, and that sort of thing. But at that time, when you, look, when you looked at most sports at that time, um, sports science was still just a tiny little part of what they did here. So actually finding the opportunities particularly as a woman at that time, I found that quite tough. It was really hard to find someone that was willing to give you the opportunity to um, do that sort of thing there. So as part of the role at the SFA, I went in to do the administration there for the central region. Um, so it was all the kind of grassroots uh, organisation and stuff that they do there. So I really um, ended up in the kind of administrative roles. And once you're kind of there, it's kind of hard to break out of that but at the same time actually I really enjoyed it and um, I find it's it's really um, interesting kind of behind the scenes role to make sure that everything runs properly in the bit that you do see. Yeah and how did you find that transition at first because it must have been pretty pretty different for you as well? It was fairly smooth because at the time you still I was still doing enough of the sports science side of things so I worked at the school of football project that they run and then with the girls uh, national team set up um, so it was kind of doing both of those two things at the same time but it got to a point where you kind of had to do one or the other um, and I sort of ended up doing the administration side of things really. And you've obviously seen a few sides of it as well but how do you find working in a football environment? It's really fun it's it's really varied I can see how it wouldn't be for everyone. You, you kind of have to know what you're signing up for, I think, a lot of the time. You kind of just have to roll with that, but everybody is, you know, is, is really fun to work with. It is a really fun, it's usually quite a friendly environment um, as well, and so it is, it's really nice uh, working with a lot of the guys um, uh, on a day-to-day -day basis. You kind of get to know a lot more about people. I've been here since, uh, since it was just the, the um, academy side and then with the women's team moving up here it's been really great to see the so many more opportunities coming across um, for, for women to get into those kind of roles which were the roles which as I say when I graduated from university 15 years ago they really weren't there in the same numbers or the same capacities for, for women and it's, it's really nice as well knowing that there are women coming in who aren't necessarily connected with football they are um, they are just coming fresh from university or from other sports or other jobs, even just coming into, into football, which wasn't something that you saw in the past. It was always football people that got football jobs. Um, and I think that's been, uh, it's been really great to see, see them coming in here and doing that.